Hey and welcome back to this new video. You may or may not ask yourself, wait, where's the second part of the knife making video? Well, it's on its way. But in the meantime, I picked up this massive old post-wise, leg-wise, whatever you want to call it. I got it from a nice guy living near my place and he gave it to me for just 25 euros, roughly about 30 dollars. So what I will do now is getting the rust off it, taking it all apart, cleaning it up and mounting it to a large lock. Those bolts were so tight that I couldn't unscrew them. I just left this whole thing together. This whole thing has been used as a decoration element in the backyard. The traces that these 10 years of garden time left were tons of rust and a bucket full of dirt inside the vice body. I cleaned off all these small parts on the drill press and decided to use a rust converter for the first time. I didn't like the finish that much, so I only used it on small parts, not on the whole vise.
The screw itself was in really good shape. There's just been a ton of old grease on it, so I wiped it clean and wire brushed it. There was barely no rust and chipping on this piece, which I was very happy about. I've got this awesome huge lock to mount the vise on and I decided to burn the ends and then also try to seal them to make them last longer while sticking in the dirt. As soon as it is warm again, maybe in April, I will stick them in concrete. After this awesome natural fade out, I set up the vise on the next day. To remove the last bits of rust, I tried out this Rust Remover 5000. It's gluten free, what makes it so efficient. You just spray it on and wipe away the rust like magic. Man, I wish I would have tried this before. I really recommend this product, but you know, this isn't just water and magic, it won't flow out of your tap. It's super expensive and really hard to get. Jokes aside, let's finish this piece. And here's what the vice is looking like now. 
I absolutely love this piece. It is so heavy duty and I think I will have much fun using it. As always, thank you for watching this new video. If you want to see more videos like this one and also want to watch me setting up my forging area and if you are interested into knife making, make sure to subscribe. Leave me a thumbs up if you liked the video and write a comment to tell me what you liked and also what I can make better next time. Also make sure to check out my Instagram account to place a custom order on your dream knife. Have a nice day and keep grinding.